All right, today we're gonna paint a Big Mac um, based off that story where they serve Big Macs in the White House instead of proper White House five-star meal. <laughs> I thought it was a great story to have uh, Trump's Big Mac on here. All right, so the question of the day is, what was the origin of the Big Mac? Let's run through the colors. Titanium white, Mars black, Van Dyke brown, Burn Umber, Yellow Ochre, Twin Blue, Phala Blue, Phala Green, Primary Yellow, Pearly Orange, Quin Red, Pearly Red. Let's get the party started. <laughs> Get the Big Mac kind of in. We're gonna um, solidify these colors, this blue and the red, and make it much more popping. Right now, it's very faded. Um, gonna fill in the bun, make it more three dimensional, get a little more toasty on the ends, a little wider in some ends, and kind of clarify between the pickles and the lettuce um, and some of the sauces coming out here. So, we'll see how that goes. <laughs> So the Big Mac obviously is um, a product of McDonald's. However, they invented it in 1967, but they did it as a competition against the Big Boy. So Big Boy is a franchise in the middle of the United States. It's not international at all, as far as I know. And they're focused on, uh, it's very similar to the Big Mac, and they invented it in 1937 as kind of a joke. Uh, they took this hamburger, someone said, hey, we want something special. So they made a ridiculous tower burger, which is very similar to the Big Mac, and then they became super popular, right? So, this franchisees of McDonald's, Bull Galetti, um, he's like, dude, we gotta compete with the big boy. How are we gonna compete with the big boy? So he invented his own version of the big boy. Originally, it was called the Aristocrat, and then later they tried the name Blue Ribbon Burger, and both those names failed. <laughs> no one could remember them or what they were, or, what they were about, 
And so they switched to Big Mac, which is very similar to Big Boy Big Mac, right? So that's the origin of the Big Mac. All right, we just finished the painting. Let's take a closer look. We have kind of the top with the Big Mac, uh, sesame seeds on there, the cheese outlined at the bottom, kind of pickles and lettuce. Uh, they're not really distinctive. I didn't draw, per se, a pickle in there. And that's all kind of the same color, so I just say, ah, whatever. You see the lettuce, and um, yeah, it's probably good enough. <laughs> uh, it reads like a burger. I think the colors were a little better before. Uh, those burger um, colors were um, difficult to make because uh, you have to mix the colors and kind of guess what elements in those colors. Um, it's not an easy color to find um, mixing around. So, you know, I think someone that painted longer maybe, or mixing a lot of paint every day, would have an idea what those colors are, but I'm just kind of like, whatever. <laughs> it reads like a burger, but I think the colors could be a little better. Um, I really like the brilliant uh, red to blue uh, contrast that makes it really fun. I didn't put like a defining line, I don't think it needed to in this case. Um, very strong color overall. But yeah, I think it reads like a Big Mac. Um, at least kind of. <laughs> anyway, I hope you guys like it. Uh, give me a thumbs up. If you want to subscribe, you can subscribe below. And I'll see you in the next painting video. Thanks for watching, guys.